unnecessary shit, bro. What? I'm just no. Someone said this to me. Aiden, this is who banned you. This is the moderation. Again, bro. This is this is from back in my day. I don't even think these guys work there anymore. This is from back in my day when hey, I was hey, getting in trouble. Do not call them guys. You cannot assume their pronouns, please. Okay. I'm just saying, train. Do not assume. Seriously, bro. It's fucked up. All right. Okay, from these individuals. There you go. You know, I don't know, but they might not go by that either. Don't assume. Jesus Christ, bro. Listen, point is this. This is it, Chad. Look. Um, I just want to say, wait, why is everyone saying ask trade about destiny? What the, I don't, I don't go. They're all telling me to talk to destiny. What happened? What, 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 what's this destiny shit, trade? Well, I've been a, you know, I like destiny. I want to get destiny on the platform. I think, uh, I think he'd be great for kick. You know, I'm in talks with them. That, that's someone I want to get over here. I think he is invaluable to the platform. I think we need somebody, you know, despite. I'm sure when he comes on, he'll have criticisms for Kick. I'm sure he'll have criticisms for me. I'm sure he'll talk some shit about you. That's, you know, uh, uh, objective. And, Wait, does he like you know, me or no? Unbiased. I've never, I've never talked to him before. I'm is not he... sure. I'm not sure. You have to talk to him and find out. But I, I think he's invaluable to the platform. I think he's super underrated. And at the end of the day, tomorrow he can go have a two-week rant of why I'm terrible. But I'm still going to stand by what I say. He's invaluable, and I think we need to bring him on. And I think he's been treated like shit from Twitch. I think that ban, I think they could have talked to him and maybe... Uh, you know, handle that better, but I think to take him out after, you know, the 10 year plus of commitment he had on that platform, I think is a mistake and a disrespect to the work he's done. How do you get banned? What are you doing to get banned? What are you doing to get banned from Twitch? Uh, he made some controversial comments that um, I don't think he meant in that way, but it was taken in the worst possible way. Uh, I'm say? not sure. I'm, you have to talk to him about it. I don't want to, I don't want to say something. I don't, I don't know anything about it, so I don't want to say anything like he can explain that to you i i'm not sure all i know is i do think he is he's somebody i do like and i do think um is undervalued and underappreciated so i definitely want to get him over here but yeah if you want to ever talk to him you can talk to him and he'll feel, feel you what about there. what about um nick fuentes on this platform i have no comment <laughs> regarding that <laughs> okay what about uh oh um ice poseidon yeah, I think Ice, uh, dude, I, I think Ice has, like, reformed, and he's grown up, and I think he is also someone that I would like to bring over here as well. We did get Bruce and Kai. They're going to Oh, for sure. Oh, Bruce needs to, want, dude, I love Bruce. Dude, it, dude, I don't know if you know this. Back in the day, when Bruce was a smaller streamer, when he first started out, I was bringing him on the podcast. Uh, dude, me and Bruce go a little back. Obviously, we disconnected for a long while in the last two, three years, but... He used to be over on the podcast where we used to crack a lot of jokes. Like, he used to call me certain names, and I used to say he looked like Dr. Doolittle. That's actually funny. He does look like Eddie Murphy. He Wait, does a little bit. No. What about, about Ricegum? Can we get Ricegum? I think Ricegum could come, yeah. Ooh. Can we get Donald Trump a deal? No. You broke up there. Sorry, what did you say? Dude, we need to get Soldier Boy. I'm not even joking. Like, Soldier Boy would make cr go crazy on cake, bro. We need Soldier Boy on cake. Okay. Hey, listen, you send a list over, bro, I'll get him over. Trust me, I have a long list of people already coming over. You do? It's crazy. Dude, it, bro, it's crazy Those uh, these streamers calling you a liar for the people that want to come over. Like, why are they calling you a liar? Like, do, do these people know what you and I know? I'm confused. I know. You know what's crazy, Train? <laughs> you and I actually know a lot of people who like are coming to kick. Like, why crazy. are these people calling you a liar and going out on a limb based off of nothing? Everyone's like, calling me a liar and shit. Like, oh, kick's gonna fucking crumble in a month. Like, are they no, this motherfucker. scared? Of There's a big signing every people. month. I know, bro. I know. I know. I know. It's crazy, it's bro. Crazy, bro. These motherfuckers, crazy, bro. You, you know what's nuts? I actually brought it up the other day. It's funny how, for certain things. Right, so if you were to say, let's say Kai's coming over, they'll sit there and say, you're a liar. Yeah, you're There's a no fucking liar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, have, you have no credibility to say that. And then you'll say something else, and just because it matches their narrative of pushing hate towards you, oh, Aiden said this on stream, he has the credibility and all this stuff, he shouldn't be saying that. Bitch, didn't you just say he has no credibility, he shouldn't exactly. be trusted, no one believes him, when it matches one narrative, and then when the narrative is that he has a lot of credibility, he shouldn't be saying this. Like, right. Why are they picking and choosing when you have credibility no and when you don't based on narratives that match their narratives that get them the most popularity points? It's the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. I I'm surprised no one's caught on to this shit. No, Does that make any sense? It's ridiculous, bro. It's fucking ridiculous. It's just all a bunch of fucking dick suck, irony, and just complete corruption, bro. That's, that's the three words, Chad. That's the three fucking words. You know what? This might sound corny and cringe, but fuck, I'm going to say it. 
Fuck Twitch, I'ma just kick it. And that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad, right? That, that was wasn't kinda, bad. That, that was kinda cool. Put some god take your feet off. Put some socks on. Oh my god, bro. Really? That's the first thing you say to me, bro? No. Well bro. For, well, first of all, you're allowed to do that. I'm just saying that I'm I'm not a foot. I mean, you do have nice feet. That's weird. I don't mean it like, oh my uh. No, I don't mean it like that. What I'm not a foot fuck? guy like that. What I, no no chill, bro. I don't I'm not a foot guy, okay? What I'm saying just put train. Whatever, train. Anyways, bro. Um this dude has a foot fetish. I do not have a foot fetish, bro. I do not listen, nah, bro. No, 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 bro. Listen, if we ever hang out, you better have socks on. Why are you talking so lengthy? Bro, you know, guys, I didn't tell you what happened. Yo, I don't think I told you this. Train, I was working out and I was wearing these these underwear that you guys know like this certain underwear. Like I, it was honestly cheap underwear. Pretty like millionaire wearing cheap underwear. I, I was wearing like five dollar draws or two dollar draws or whatever the fuck it was, right? And the lint got in my pee hole, bro, and it started like itching and burning and just ugh. I kept like scratching my cock and like ugh. And, and I had to get in the shower. Cause it was like sweaty and like getting in there and shit. Like ugh. Wait, 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 wait. Are you, are you circumcised? Yeah, of course. I'm Jewish. Okay. So, when, so, you're, so when you're Jew, you have to get a brisk. Wait, what are you saying? Yeah, I'm, I'm circumcised as well. I'm circumcised as well, dude. The, 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 those anteater cocks, just, the, yeah, that's some animal planet shit. You know what I'm saying? Know, that's some animal planet shit. No, it is. It is. It is for sure. Fucking anteating ass motherfuckers. It's kind of like that toy you see from Peter River Pizza with enough tickets. You know what I'm saying? There was like water in it. And never mind. Anyways, um, so what happened? You got shit stuck in your pee hole? Lint. Lint from my underwear, my boxers. Someone said he got a yeast infection. Hold on, no, hold on, hold on. Listen, hold on. I got brother, brother. black lint in my pee hole, bro. Yeah, yeah, but you realize that in order for that to happen, your dick, while it's in a flaccid form, would have to be pressed up against your underwear, which means, like, were you in cold water? Because you, usually when, when you're soft, you're, 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 your dick's hanging downwards. It's not even touching the underwear. It's, it's, it's hanging down, right? Oh, I thought I showed it. D Right? Well, I want to look, but I don't know. Like, hold on, let me... You know what I'm saying? It's not hanging up where it's touching. Like, like it's not, it's not hang, hanging uh, uh, perpendicular to the to the. Okay, underwear. no, but like it was, it was up in the motion type shit, and um, I don't know. It... Never mind, bro. Never mind. Oh shit, bro. So what did you do? You picked it out with tweezers? No, I had to get in the shower and I just rubbed it and I just like went like this, like ugh. Wait, how deep did it go? Not that deep, just like a little bit of a tip. But it was burning, like it just hurt. What the f what? It's, not, it's not an STD chat. Oh my god. Like people are saying you have AIDS. No, bro. Listen. Wait, you sh you sh bro, just get a lint roller. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it wasn't that it wasn't that deep. It wasn't that deep. It wasn't that deep. But nah. Um No, it wasn't that deep. But look, bro, I you know, I my thing is this, man. It's 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 like last thing I'll say on this whole Twitch shit. Train. You just gotta be smart with the Twitch stuff, bro. You just gotta well, be smart with that. Like, well, let me I ask you, I'll train. You. Train, can I just ask you a question? Yeah, what's good? I'll show you my excuse. I'll show you my uh, my, my email. Obviously, you won't leak it to anyone. But when you read it, you're gonna be like, what the fuck? Why do you genuinely believe I got banned? Be honest. Um, so I'll be honest, okay? And this doesn't only apply to Twitch. It applies to pretty much anyway well it does apply to twitch mainly but it does apply to other places as well listen people like you and i right now more so probably you and some others listen they're always looking for anything do you understand they're looking for something and you're asked sometimes you say some wild ass shit which like i know deep down you're a good kid right you're a good kid you're a good dude deep down some of the shit you say i think misrep misrepresents who you are sure do you believe it probably but do you mean it in the way you're saying it? Probably not, right? That's what it means to give the benefit of the doubt. Unfortunately, we live in a world where people aren't giving the benefit of the doubt anymore. They're, they're applying the worst possible context you could have meant. So since we're in that world right now, you have to be very careful in giving your enemies the reason that they need, right? So for example, when all, when all the, ignore Twitch for a moment. When all these guys come at you, sometimes you'll say dumb shit when you're not even about it. And you're giving these guys a free hall pass to absolutely not only shit on you, but win the shitting on you, right? So you, you just gotta be real careful when you're, a, when, when you're in a snake pit. You know what I'm saying? It's wait, so, so chat, wait, do I sometimes say dumb shit? Be honest, yes or no? 
I don't think I do. Like, I just, I think people just, I, the way I say it sometimes, people just, like, misconceive it and, and, and believe and portray it as me saying some stupid shit. But I'm, I, don't, I, don't, I don't classify myself. Well, bro, as, think, well, no, think, think of it this way, Aiden, right? If, if, I, if, I, if I'm at a party with the boys, you know what I'm saying, and I say some shit, right? You know what? Fuck, fuck the example about me. Think about rap music, bro, right? When the normal civilian hears a rapper say, you know, that bitch a hoe, she sucked my, you know, she sucked my dick, swallow, that's all she's good for. We're not thinking, oh, Fast. fuck. Like, we're, not, we're not thinking the worst case. It's, it, we get it. We get what he's referring to. We know he doesn't mean every woman, you know. He means that one, you know, 